Hey, Seahawk fans, I'm Tom Reard, and I'm joined by Zarian Sharp, who just signed a professional contract with, with the Minnesota Twins. First of all, hey, congratulations, Z. That, that's a great honor, and I know you're looking forward to it. Uh, but what, what, what has you most eager about beginning a professional career? Um, I probably had to say, honestly, the journey, you know, uh, just getting started somewhere new, you know, going and playing against some of the, hopefully some of the best players you know, in the country and from around the world and just getting a pro career started, starting in the minor leagues and just having that journey of going up to the major leagues. It's always been a dream of mine, so I just can't wait to do that. Right, right. Now, uh, at what point in your UNCW career, or your high school career for that matter, did you realize, hey, you know, I got a great opportunity or a chance to play at that next level? Was there was it something that you were doing? Was it just something you – you said you always strive to do it. But what was that one point where you know it? You sat there and you're like, "Yeah, man, I I, I can I can play pro ball." Um, honestly, the time kind of came and went. You know, in high school, you know, I always thought about it, but the results weren't there. And then I had a great freshman year, and towards the end, you know, I really started to, you know, I guess progress how I wanted. And that's when I kind of thought, like, okay, like maybe in, you know, in about two years, I. I'll have a chance. And then, you know, my sophomore year, I missed most of that uh, right. with the injury. So, you know, those thoughts kind of you know, backtracked just a little bit. And, but honestly, it didn't really hit me until about the end of my junior year when, you know, I started getting some calls from some scouts. And, you know, they were just asking me, you know, where do you see yourself in the draft this year? And that was probably really the first time where I was like, okay, like, I know I pretty I have a pretty good chance of playing pro ball. And then once you hear stuff like that, it just kinda of gives you, you know, that bit of confidence. And even though I didn't get even though I didn't go after getting taken after my junior year, you know, that confidence just kinda, of, you know, kept going with me and to this day, I mean, obviously from yesterday it's always been a dream of mine and it finally came true. Very good. Now during your career with UNCW you had, you know, twelve wins. As you said you missed most of your sophomore with an injury. Uh, you had wins over Kentucky, and you had a win over Arizona State. You know, two pretty good programs. You know, had a lot of guys drafted. Uh, but was there a game in your in your career that really stood out to you that you like? You were just like, "This is awesome! I, I just love this." You know, that kind of feeling. Oh yeah, there's a couple. Probably my first one I'd say was my freshman year. Uh, through a complete game against JMU. Okay. And that's probably been my favorite one so far, just because, you know, it's my only complete game of my career since being here. So I'd probably say that was probably the most fun. Okay. And that's also a game that, that clinched a, a CA tournament berth for the Seahawks that year. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. So that was a pretty good win right there. Now uh, – you signed with the Twins. Did you have any kind of familiarity with, with the organization at all? Yes, I did. Um, obviously, you know, former former teammate, Ryan Jeffers, one of their top prospects. So, um, you know, just talking to him, um, he just talked about, you know, how much of a family atmosphere they have and how comfortable he is with not only people in the organization, but as far as player development. So that was one of the big things that really – you know, help me make a decision. And also, uh, one of the scouts, um, name's Tyrone Dawson. He was originally at North Carolina A&T when I was in high school, and he recruited me pretty heavily, you know, coming out of high school. And, you know, just talking to him, he was like, well, I don't really want to lose twice to you in a recruiting trip. So he obviously did a pretty good job and, you know, said something, right? Did. Yeah. yeah so. <laughs> Well, very good. I'm sure, you know, Ryan's had a great career thus far with, with the Twins, and he's really progressed quickly uh, through through that organization. Um, through your time at UNCW, what do, you, what do you what do you value most about being a student athlete at, at UNCW? Oh, man, there's a lot. At first, I, you know, I just had to say, you know, the atmosphere that, one, our coaches bring, you know, they instill like a – you know, the blue-collar work ethic, you know, with us being a mid-major program, we feel like we're – we feel like we're not a mid-major. We feel like we can compete with anybody, and we've shown that with, you know, wins at, like, Kentucky, you know, series at Arizona State, going all these regionals. Uh, so, you know, just 
how they come about, how they come to work, and it just, you know, checks down the line. And two, you know, just the family atmosphere with the guys. I've played with some really talented guys for four years that I've been at UNC Wilmington. But, you know, since day one, from the seniors that were there when I got there, like Robbie and Casey Gold and those guys, you know, they just brought in that that family atmosphere and made everybody feel comfortable. And, you know, as I've gotten older and some of the guys in my class have gotten older, you know, we just try to keep that going. And uh, like I said, that family atmosphere, just making everybody feel apart and making everybody feel together. And that only not only helps with, you know, on the baseball field, but, you know, once we leave as well. Very good. Well, Zarin, hey, I appreciate you, you know, taking some time out of your day. I know you're busy. But uh, again, congratulations on signing with Minnesota Twins. Uh, I also want to thank you. We had a lot of Twins fans on our website last night checking out your stats. So I appreciate the web traffic you brought to us. But uh, hey, best of luck, and we look forward to following you. All right. Appreciate it, Tom. Thank you. You got to take care.